you have and you can assist us and come from those things. We thank God for the Even yesterday as we were sitting here, one of our kids said, bro, we said, please, we will be in the office next week. He said, no, I do have a say here. Here is the same police around your, your, your house. And also this morning, we do not have any So we think everything is going to be. So I don't have any years, they so what they just say. Don't be scared. So you can see how many problems we have. So sometimes men create problems, sometimes women create problems. Don't be scared, brothers. We are here. Fight for the rights of the women. But they are working in time. When a lecturer from Chantala, a professor, what we have to say from Chantala to Morgan, it was when you reach Morgan and the student was pretty answer, your shoes are, you are holding your shoes, you are not putting on your shoes. So, oh, and you put the shoes down and wear the shoes. Please, take me for that power. So, we have to fight for that man, for the woman to come back to her normal senses. But it's here that she will be happy. Do you see this people in the office to come and say, Madam, I'm going to go to the city. There are some cases that are taken to court if they want to call the court. You know, in the court, they keep on postponing the cases, adjournment, adjournment, adjournment. We are the ladies at the start, and both of us are after. They can speak this grammar and they can speak to uh, adjoin the cases. But we wrap up. Here and then, Papa Papa is the text stuff. And we feel that this. And God, Allah is always on our path. We are dying, we are dying. He always support us and show us the direct way of traveling this moment that we brought to us. We thank Allah for that. And thank you for all your work. For all your work. However, uh, we want to look at. We have answered the question. I'm going to ask you to give you an invitation. You are going to know. But I want you to come back on Monday. We have two cases of the uh, money. Why is I work for seven years? They are coming back to the case. Thank you. 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 Thank where violence against women is prevalent, and former former outlets are far too rich. Where is the violence against women dominant? In Nigeria, in Nigeria, Aguara, 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 Aguara. Now I want to ask, who is going to talk to our dear state coordinator? If a woman today. The woman today is abused in Aguara. The kind of response you have here in Mina would be like they enjoy it. But I know that women are being abused there. Girls are being abused. So, how do we work in those part of the community? We have the shelter in front here. There. In order for us to work through the community structure, is it the principal? Is it the traditional ruler? Is it the leader of the culture? Is it the good in measuring that population that we call the Google Mama that knows the area of this case? How do we ensure 
all that. They can do something for the extra five minutes. You can also fight for the right of young child and women. So any time they have cases of court, they report to form one direct. And the form one will stand on her, on her own and go to social media because in all the other governments, we have form one. And they are also very far from those people. Let's start for her. You have answered it. That is the network thing we are looking for. I am not here for my voice being heard. I am not here for the one we are preventing for here is also standing down in our lives. It, it is then, it is then very necessary for there to be a linkage between what Rapa knows, what Rapa knows, and what is happening in forward. Do we have that strong message? Do we compare those? Do we uh, do maybe case management? At the end, I think that the case management now, now be the lawyer. Have you actually done a still transfer working with this kind of networks that are everywhere? We have a former, we have a car man, we have a seed of people. Where our lesson and knowledge have we had? Every space saying what we are saying in Mina. That is what we want to institute today. So that not just rapper. I'm not going to stay in Mina. Yet I am in Niger State. Thank you, ma'am. Have I asked a question? Yeah, let me say thank you, ma'am. Let us take Baba. He has the rest of his time. Thank you, ma'am. 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 Give her a 
the So then the person is behind with somebody among them. Yeah. They have to find that word. They find up the and then he wanted to have the mother. Who is the I the brother has two other brothers. So we took her, brought her here to that brother. And then, over the whole world, we took her here to meet her for two years. So, I'm going to have to, I would like the brothers to come back. We tell them to do more. Well, although we are trying to make the law possible for us to pay to the under government fund. And we are paying now. The law says that the mother will have control of the And the mother has a problem with the father. They have access to him. But have a bad have a bad have a I <laughs> 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 Well, I need to do So, little the I don't know the man of the man what the people that are going to do is the and the of and the wolf like that. Thank you, sir. I think that we have had enough. We have had enough. We have had enough. Let me focus again. What are we looking for? We have discovered that some areas have. Uh, we also discovered a particular one or two uh, pe pe peculiar cases are privileged, which is early marriage, forced marriage, or other practices. Is it kidnapping in self? Okay. There are very, very common issues in Niger State. We have also mentioned some of the sources and the ability to support that we have used in supporting them. One thing we should not forget is that within this framework, we have discussed on the need for networking. Yeah. Networking, like that place that came from, from far. Somebody, an organization in that place, would have worked in tandem with the first person who had on it, and what you would have done here, you would have also done there. The next question, please. Let's continue. Okay, what kind of strategic stakeholders do we want to achieve this with in the United States? Even this one we have said is, we have mentioned we want to include this class of institutions, we want to include those that came in or 
my mother has always known that girls who go and tell the secret or the primary health care center, but why we may not be able to include some of them is because they are a formal organization. So let's think it in our community organization. For instance, if you want to use part of an issue, and the Ministry of Education said, if you say that you are God, it might be difficult for that person to be able to be transparent in that case. But we mustn't forget the fact that they are quite important when it comes to response. They are quite important. So which particular discourse of partnership with local government bodies? Which local government bodies do you want to partner with? Which religious leaders? That is within the cases you have mentioned. Which religious users, community organizations, and other regular stakeholders to gather support and ensure sustainability of the initiative, placing for protection and the support from One of the things that enhances sustainability is working in partnership. One of the things you see when you are doing social work and are not strategic, you get tired. You see yourself, uh, so a lot of people who offer all your food. Remember you are in human beings. Maybe at that time you are sleeping. You have gone all the day, you are tired. But if there is somebody closer to that person, you will not have to leave your home and drive at the middle of the night. All you will be able to do is please support me. So 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 case is a so so basis. So where who can we partner with in Niger State here? So that when we next to come, we will have women of residence almost in every location. Which traditional leaders do we want to partner with? Which are the ones we want to partner with? Which uh, uh, leaders of culture and faith do we want to partner with? Which other strategic local government uh, organizations and bodies do we want to partner with? I think we have to go now. I want to show you the chair of our house from the area to that. What we have on the grassroots is what we call Wakili Meowa. That is, is subordinate to Meowa. Then, from Meowa, the whole Meowa, the whole of the area, maybe you have 20 or 30 streets in your own villages under you. I say, my work. Or if you are in the village and you have one village as a young work, you have areas. So, these areas you have put to go working in that area. So that you will soon have a problem in the event that or something of that nature, you will be the best thing to channel the report to you. That this is what is going on so surface. And each of the areas have put to go works. You have a works that you have in mind. You understand? So the man is part of the working of that very community. Three, if there are other tribes. What you are saying is very important. Okay. People are not hearing, I don't know what working is, but I will notice it. Please. So if you have other tribes in your mix in that community, I'm not talking in terms of uh, the urban city alone now, I'm talking of even in the place. We are, you can see, a separate area of uh, the house of people who so will buy you, to blow the air, to blow the gas, maybe they come for business in that area. So, what we do now is each of the tribes, if they are up to 10 or 20, we give one of them, we will bring out one leader out of them. Anything we have to do, we call their leader to stand for them. If there is any case, we bring the leader down to sit down and listen to the gate. If there is any judgment that is what they will pass or set them up, let him know they, they play a fair play within the discussion uh, issue. You understand? So these are the partners from Mayangua to village head. If the case did not surpass the Wadi, did not surpass the Mayangua, it will not go to work with all village they will not all damage. You understand? Then the world members will gather and discuss this issue before they take it to the 
we have taken it now to what we call Hakimi. From Hakimi, which is called this unit, is now to the area. In person, the real issue in my community, how I put it, is what I want to tell you. What I do is, who is involved in this revolution? I have one case that happened in my community. I was a evil man, a shoe shine in my community. So, he has a friend in Sabon Gate. Sabon Gate, from five way to Sabon Gate, even if you are doing pay the bike during when the oil was still with something, you have to pay almost 200 men. So what that man used to do is to change 2020 new ones and bring it to that man. They call him Papa. So when they bring it, if there is a girl they have settled with, then you call that man. They will now come and enter into Papa's uh, room to do a kind of this. So what they unfortunate for them. I will see what is doing. I take the landlord and I don't want to see this man in this house. When they say bye bye to him in that house, one lady gave him a, a room is in, in her house. So I, I was a tailor very close to him. I now tell the tailor, please put eye for this man for me. This is what is happening. He said, One day, that small girl of primary four was going to school. So she entered into the house. As she entered into the house, that tailor went to the step and started. Papa, 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 what do you do with this girl? Papa, Papa, what do you do with this girl? Say, I will go, I will give her a shoe. 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 Look, you know, I was passing by. I just hear that. And tell me what is going on. So, now, one girl is a Papa Lumo. And when the girl comes out, she will not be pet. I call Papa. Papa, what do I do with this girl? So, I was looking at her. I was looking at her. I was not on this. If I call these guys, they say bye to me and doing something with that. I'm telling you, you are leaving my community or you will go to prison. He refused to tell me the truth. And now it's time for the girl that should, they should follow the girl and catch her from the road to go to school. Probably school. When they catch the girl, I now say, Papa, tell me what to do. He said, No, that's all. If I reach my house, don't tell me you are going to prison. I promise to go. When we reach my compound, and I will tell you, come, come and see me. I say, see me for what? Tell me, you say, you get the call, you tell her, say, you feel out. So when they give her a hundred red eye every day, so today when she say, you never see me, you don't go to job for, for school. And then you can't give her a hundred red eye. So you give her a hundred red eye, that is very good. No problem. And now they start to get her and see that when she was trying to, she was trying to force her out, Two of us step in the hand like this. And another the papa I said, tell me the truth before I call people that will watch you go. And the people are now sent for the parents of this girl. And they sent for the working people that I have in my community. And now sent for the elders to sit down and listen to this case. At the end of the day, he was pleading with me, and this is what has been happening. The next thing that will happen, he didn't go, because he was not having fun with him in that place. That one was a woman, now come. And when they start chasing the one, so when they start beating them, they now tell the truth. And this is what happened, this is what happened. What the next, he took him to the station, and um, as he was trying to do the thing out, Barrister Fati said, man, uh, uh, she's now a, a, a judge in the United States. She was there, the, the Party Pakuma, thank you. I called her and she told me that she was in Porto Mora. I said, because the DP was there, I mean, this is his right. If you go there, this is what you do. She now called one of their subordinates and went to the station with me, collected that money, they put it there, take it to the court, and they keep it there for a while. Though I didn't refuse the court to measure the case because I wanted to punish. And I leave him there for two years. Without the kids. Not the country, as a papa. Send some people to me, bear with me, and tell me this man leave his wife for over 20 years with children. Start. No, 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 no,
So please, I shall allow this one to go to his office. And that is how I now release the one. He has left this state in totality. We have a lot of it. But if you say uh, you will join us, one person cannot fight this war. Thank you. Because I know, I know the account of 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 the 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 let me sit down. Sick and let me drop. As he was speaking, I feel like being a uh, maybe hypocritic person. I should start putting he thought of structure. If you are listening to me, he thought of structure. He also spoke about community surveillance in such a way that no one can do it alone. He partner. So please let me learn all oh, and he has said now. If you solve this question, you are don't worry. Oh, well, I was happy to speak. Thank you very much. Look at him, he comes up with the law. They ensure that every community, even within the Angua, they have a team. Am I right? Mm -hmm. Then, if the Wapili cannot do it, come to the Angua. Even within that Wapili, they still have laws. And they have the uh, aliens. I mean, sorry, the mass. And even within self sector the world, they will still have toxins. Mm -hmm. See the way they take hope. No, that is fantastic. This is what they call violence against women and girls. Community this whole team. Another round of applause. Some they will not do it the day. They will do it in the night. Oh, they will put back down with it and take. See, everybody is important in this world. Everybody. Look who is nothing that they get off as a common advocate. Why are you in the world? Because this is not how you can look at it. Thank you, well done. Well, you well done, sir. Uh, okay. Central Bank is set very well because he has given us solution to how we network with a range of partners. Thank you. I don't know how one of the girls, she said this. What do the one who are working on the Nigeria Science under the we have to form children club in the Nigeria world. Two clubs for children so that they think that among themselves, then they report cases. We have two clubs where children can tell them what and what is involved and how they can report cases to the nearest. So you can have something like that in community because they have here, yeah, they have some small local things that we can engage so that we tell them they can they are they can report the they can report. They can report, they can report any other person that is close by you that don't come to school. And we have uh, this um, sexual assault reparation center where you have counselors that you can even work there and uh, see what cases they have. They have a the lawyer there, they have a the counselor, they have a uh, um, nurse there that can easily uh, take care of cases uh, before they get to school. Thank you, ma'am. Excellent. Also, those more children themselves have to improve, they can support. Simply touch of what has happened to one of them. And uh, you said something now. How many sacks do you have in Nigeria? How many? Four. Sacks. Sacks. Four. That's five. Uh, you were talking about the fact that you have to be in the fact that we have to be in the fact that we have to be in the We used to invite the youth from different areas to our office. We cancelled them and then we made some of the ambassadors of their area. Then we have a case that our problems have been solved and we are able to solve their problems. The husband and the wife become the ambassadors of their children. And then we used to call them from time to time. If they have any cases, 
They report to Rapa and we sent some of our lawyers to handle the case. But definitely needs to try and process the case in the Catholic sector to see how to resolve the problem without going to the court. So we partner with the city and work. And these people, anything about this, the lawyer, yeah, the court and the lawyer. Yeah. There is a lot of different houses to buy using things. So sometimes we get some information from them. Sometimes we just sit to them and they will bring the amen. Ah, that house, that woman is talking a lot. So we use practice to go into such houses to bring the woman out because some of them are afraid to come out. Speak, but this is what they are going to be about that. But we thank God. Since after the riding and uh, the, the, the riding book, the CPV, the CPV group and the women that are here, since that first riding, ma, you see, maybe, that will open everybody's eyes. Both the girls, the women, the husband, every day that time you see the girls are having a ceremony. So, Thank you, my wife, you did the best one. We will have to go from there. Uh, I'm going to take the hint. The hint, then I'll walk to the front and be deliberate. Nobody has come to an answer to that. Down from. So I'll walk the front. Thank you. Good afternoon. I think my first recommendation is I will recommend Rapa or everybody to partner with the speed of duty. Because people have one of the strongest methods that people don't even know about. Because a lot of people tell their stories while we are there because they think that's important to us and we get the stories from there. We can help you uh, have the stories and I think uh, being the chairman of one of the wings for the past eight years, even during this election, I was able to convert for more than 40,000 votes for this government. So that is to tell you, we have a very strong network that we can get information from everywhere because we are united. So I want to recommend partnering with us because that will create a lot of things. I think I knew what he was going to say. He said, Abaya is one of the estates to the governor. Uh, thank you for your very, very useful. The people, because people see their vulnerability and want to take advantage of them. Thank you. Thank you for that. Because in some communities, they do the rap system, they are called informant too. And what will be the future of those informants in the community? Because some of them, if they report this to the authority, they will be informed. And what will be the future of I think that question. Uh, anybody can answer. But yesterday, or day before yesterday, we said safe, safe, uh, safe uh, intervention. Mm. Why do you want to report? People without being an informant. The cases of LGBT, both, is a sensitive case. In fact, you might even come in as a sympathizer. It is the wife that talk to a sympathizer that will keep you away. There's also a good person that is not to do this. So let us do this before the team. Although that's not what we are asking for here. But we are going to be very sensitive. Who wants to ask our guy? Because I think we are working with even the community, not just community, we also have security officers. We have mentioned in the last day and all of that. So how do we link up this? Who wants to help? It's true. They want to put their lives on the on live, on the live because they want to support. Yes. Sorry, you're not being a part of us. Who are you? Can you introduce okay. yourself? I'm 
but we give them the opportunity to voice out, to see the world the way it is. Because these days we, well, I can see I most of the people the here. I want to answer that question. Yeah. That's why I gave you the mic. Uh, so actually, I want to say something earlier when I was raising my hand and we were responding to other people. Okay, before yeah. you say something earlier, <laughs> ah, because we stay by life of people mm. who are supporting us in this world. So, before what you want to say that, can we respond to his question? Who has a response, a befitting response for that based on experience? The question is those that were now giving us information, whether it's a Delaria, whether it's the youth, whether it's the desk club, yeah. what level of safety is provided for them within those communities? Fine. Like in my own community, in my own organization, I, if someone comes and tell me that this is what's happening, we don't disclose that information to anyone. It's highly confidential. No matter what will happen, the worst we do is look for the person that is having that problem, we sit with her. You know, at times, let's be honest, most of you who are mothers, you are used to it, but with the upcoming girls, at least we are wise up a little, and it's high time. There are things we don't worry it. That's just it. So, we tell, we tell her that, listen, your life is way too important. We don't know what, what you're going through there. And if you said this thing that this person came and reported to us, or this thing that we had, will disclose the person's identity no matter what because of security raising also we are women most of the times if they said there's this adage in council that said everybody here are women on the other camp I think she would ask her you understand and most of the times is this small small woman that calls um that is a uplifts most of these young people's life because if someone didn't tell you they will not voice out and even when you hear it and you talk to them, they will deny it. So you have to keep pushing on faith. You get it. So in our work, we hide their person identity. No matter what happens, we don't disclose Thank you it. very much. Thank you very much. We want to go to somebody raising up her hand, his hand. We'll come back to you for what we have. So what I'm hearing from our sister and from our dad in here, I think we have a lot of work to do with our uh, number one, the person that wants to be an informer. Number two, the security that we are talking to and that is giving us away. The agencies, the police, all the people that are taken. In the civil society and the CBOs, we have what we call protocol. It then means that we can know that all that information about the survivor or the person that gave you the information. It is called confidentiality. However, did we teach that to those informers? Did we teach that? So the security and uh, uh, vigilance that we're working with, they do that to our informant. Are you doing it safe? Thank you. Let's take this last one. Then we can go on. Five. Yeah. The use of technology. Like you said yesterday, there are apps now that can support us. We will continue. We have done a lot of trash. Into visual stakeholders like a partner to move this work forward and our current strength in areas of more privilege and I say, Madam, I will not give up. Okay. Based on the initial presentation that we uh, were discussing before we asked the question, then we were talking about what can you do to what you feel into your contribution. First and foremost, we run a community-based organization. Your community is the first place for you to assist, to help, and to work with before going out. So, and I, most of the times, I encourage these young girls of my age and below my age to see the world as it is. We should start thinking outside the box. How? Most of the times, we grow up seeing some things that are not, I don't want to use the word normal, but because our parents are used to it, and we that are growing up today feel it's, it's something I cannot change. If you 